Ashay, everyone. So I just wanted to continue in that same energy for the collective reading. This is a collective message for all signs. Okay. Take the resume, be what does in the pile of rose, how they fit, guys. Thank you all so much to my new subscribers, returning subscribers, and cross watchers. Welcome back to the channel. If this reading did bring you any clarity at the end, go ahead and like the reading and subscribe to the channel. Thank you all so much for the love and support. Let's start right into the messages. I do feel like there was definitely a breakup, separation between a karmic or karmics and a divine masculine or a feminine. I feel like these divine masculines or feminine decided to walk away, heal themselves. I feel like if, they, if this has not already happened, someone is in this energy of doing this and they're determined to see this through. What's the message here? Most dominant energy spirits. Okay. So we have the four of cups, four of pinnacles upright. Yeah, so there's someone that is holding on to everything that they have, their finances, their money, their person. And this is the same energy, this king of wands upright energy. If you're not a Sagittarius, you're just in the energy of, of, in, of holding on to your things, very determined. Like I said, three of pinnacles with the six of swords is what I saw when I first opened the deck. This masculine is definitely sailing away from a group of people. This could be family members, friends, and a mixture. These groups of people are trying to hold this person down in some way, shape, or form with this hangman energy. Keep this person stagnant in life. They're going to also try again to do this with this Eight of Cups energy. We have um, Hermit with the Seven of Pentacles. A lot could have been exposed about what these people were doing, plotting, and working on. Also... Away from that, I feel like it is being exposed if that's what they're doing as of right now. Away from that, someone in this energy could be a Virgo and a Pisces. So we have the hair font reverse. They're out to break up a relationship and close out a cycle for two people here. Twin flame relationship. But a cycle is not over. And I feel like the relationship or the marriage is not over either. They're out to keep someone down by burdening them. Yeah, the tower reversed. So, yeah, they tried a lot. This group of people, they tried a lot. They tried to keep someone stagnant where they could have possibly been doing a lot of things that they shouldn't have been doing. And they tried to keep hold someone in that energy. Definitely could be a Pisces that was doing this. Um, there could be arguments and fights because someone is choosing to sail away with their family. Two or more children or just one children here. But either way, though, someone is choosing to go to calmer waters, move away from these third parties or this group of people. They're choosing to grow with the devil here in the reverse. Mature. Okay. They could have also realized that these group of people were just trying to steal. They just they they were in the seven of swords. They were in this thief mentality, thief energy, steal, steal, steal. That's all that they really wanted to do. That's all that they were really after. Steal from this divine feminine or masculine. This twin flame relationship. Stop it from growing. Yeah, with the hair font and the world reverse, I feel like they really tried to close out a cycle. They really tried to end the relationship. It didn't work. We have the Ace of Wands. So, um, Six of Cups reverse. Bad memories is getting exposed. Something about bad memories is getting exposed at this time. It has a lot to do with this masculine having a one night stand with someone. Yeah, this masculine took an offer from someone. Someone is begging and pleading this masculine to, maybe this masculine is saying, I'm going to tell them myself, okay? I feel like this masculine could be getting ready to, to tell on themselves. This person could have been bored with their everyday life and they decided to take an offer and they had a one night stand. They cheated on their person. 
And these people could have been trying to hold this over this mask on his head. Or this third party was trying to hold this over this mask on his head. Okay? I feel like that's why this third party is in this energy where they're like throwing tantrums and begging and pleading this masculine not to do this. Also, if that's not the case, then a situationship was happening here with a karmic person. And this karmic person is upset that they're the ones getting released. They thought that they were going to have a home with this masculine, um, a life with this person, a relationship, celebrations. And the, the four of wands is in the reverse because this person is a false person. Their magic that they were trying to do on someone's ten of cups definitely wore off, backfired. The star reverse. I also feel like this karmic is getting weaker and weaker. They're sexually frustrated as well. In secret. I feel like in secret, this person is sexually frustrated. But I definitely get the sense that somebody is going to either expose something about this masculine, yeah, dealing with a doppelganger, someone who likes to throw tantrums and fits and cry and someone who they don't have a sense of identity. They, they could have lied about a pregnancy. They, they, don't, they don't know how to birth new ideas. They don't know how to fucking like, they're not nurturing or healing. They're karmic. They're karmic. All they know how to do is beg, plead, and fucking throw tantrums and scream. This person is screaming right now because this masculine is about to give someone an offer. Something finance, a financial offer. Maybe this person got a new job. Because I, I do see this page of pentacles out here a lot. It's not something, you know, too much, but it's it's something new. And this karmic could have thought that this person was going to like sacrifice their family and not take care of their family and children and not take care of their home and suffer an eviction like they were wishing this or waiting for it and it's not happening they also see this person being emotionally um balanced and giving emotions to their divine feminine or masculine however this go for you um being emotionally available uh being sensitive being loving and being devoted you know and they see they they also could see a new beginning here. Yeah, this karmic's manifestations did not come true. The magician in the reverse, they thought that they came and just manifested some shit. Like something to do with like I feel like it's a group of people who felt like they they you know three is better than two or one to come up against. Something about like a group, that's for sure. Thinking that they can overpower someone else. If they come up in numbers, they felt like their manifestations as far as like someone ha suffering from an eviction or canceling some celebrations or something like that worked and it didn't. Clarify the four pinnacles. Yeah, they thought that with this hangman energy that they were like getting this masculine to to be stagnant when it comes to um, moving. This masculine is taking steps. To do something. Yeah, these people are karmics. Yeah, okay. So they thought that they, they were holding this person back from taking steps towards their divine person, their twin flame, having a healthy give and take, re reconciling. Yeah, they didn't even want me to say that word. They thought this, these, this Pisces or these people thought that they had this person stagnant, stuck. But this person was, it was either always in this determination energy or they either... Jump back into that energy of determination to go towards their person. Secrets are out about someone getting this Ten of Pentacles and who will be getting this Ten of Pentacles. I also feel like these comics, they don't see that there's an angel on that ass. Okay? There's a there's some authority on these comics' ass. That's why these manifestations are not coming true. Okay? Take a look around, comics. Clarify this King of Wands upright. Yeah, so we have the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. There's a Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. There's a karmic that that is trying to distract this Queen of this uh King of Pentacles right now, trying to get him to take this leap of faith, take this journey somewhere. They they want this person to come towards them. This Queen of Pentacles, this older energy. Okay, they thought this person was gonna come towards them. This is also someone that is very deceptive. You cannot trust the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. They're desperate. Okay, Six of Pentacles upright. 
They thought that this person was in the energy of breadcrumbing another person because of some magic that they did to keep this person in this energy where they were stagnant out of crosswords. They couldn't make a decision. They thought that that's how this person was. And it's like, nah, that's not their energy. They're determined to move forward. Three of Pentacles reverse. Yeah. These people are arguing and fighting because their manifestations are not coming true. I, um, Yeah. They're suffering bad memories when it comes to this divine feminine energy. I feel like everybody that was involved in this motherfucking group, including this masculine, because he's stressed out over here because he could have lost the money behind fucking with this group of people here. There was some money that we either paid these people or helped pay for something or gave, gave to these people. Something about money that he lost. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. We have the hermit that's being exposed. Eight of Pentacles, yeah. It has something to do with his job, wherever he was working at, okay? In the past, or maybe this is going on in your life right now, okay? This is being exposed. I also feel like if that's not the case, that then the magic that these people were doing over this divine feminine is being exposed to get this person to lose a job. They're suffering bad memories because of this. They're suffering. Because everything is coming out. Clarify the six of swords upright, please. Yeah, look. Ten of cups with the ace of cups. They wanted this woman, this divine feminine or masculine. They wanted these people to, they wanted this masculine to sacrifice this family. Okay, not take care of this family. But instead of him doing that, he's taking his family. He's moving. Yeah, he's moving to, to where there's peace. To where, where, where there's peace. He's giving the Ace of Cups to whoever is in this boat with him as well, too, going to Karma Waters. And there's, like, someone that is frustrated being haunted by demons, I feel like, or possessed because of this. Also, this person is frustrated, sexually frustrated. They're being haunted, I feel like, yeah. Because nothing that they manifested worked. They could be like screaming. This doppelganger energy could be screaming and um, literally like throwing a whole fucking tantrum. Yeah, man. This is this fucking doppelganger energy. Because this little collaboration is over. They, they're not holding this person back no more. The hangman upright. Yeah, the love was reversed. This person also, I feel like this whoever was trying to hold somebody back. They wanted to stop a cycle from closing and they thought that they were covering their tracks. They got exposed. They were getting exposed. Yeah, they, they and they think that they can get this person to accept this offer to not close out a cycle, to take a chariot, to come towards them. They're trying to get somebody to come towards them. That shit is not working. Everything is being exposed. Eight of cups reversed. But they're, they're in this energy where they keep on trying this same tactics. Yeah, these people are very deceptive. Yeah, and this divine feminine, this person's stability, and as far as like their emotions, stability, all of that, their stability, everything is protected, okay? You cannot cause this person no more or any injustice at this time. The hair font reverse. This person is sitting on their throne right now. Yeah, we got judgment upright. We got the King of Pentacles in the reverse. So they were trying to uh, make this masculine loose, the emperor in the reverse, to make a cycle not close out. This person, this karmic that is refusing to walk away, they tried to do, do put a put the masculine under um, an illusion with lies, all right? They also want this person to lose a job so that he won't be able to take care of his family. The divine is stepping in on that energy. The divine is, is stepping in. They're calling judgment down on this person who's refusing to walk away, who's trying to cause illusions, who's trying to cause this person to lose a job. Yeah, this person is definitely fucking screaming and throwing tantrums. The world reverse. Yeah, they're coming in with some type of offer or some type of um, message here. Yeah, whatever this message is, it's, it's this karmic's way of trying to get this masculine back under control. As I said in my post earlier yesterday or last night, this karmic is going to come in with this queen of swords energy. Like they know some truth or they're speaking some truth to this person. Something, um, or if it's not that, they're going to say like some type of safe word or 
show this person some type of color or like say something. This is an older energy as well. Say something to this person with a message. It's a message that's coming into this person. It's to stop a cycle from closing out where this masculine is um, moving towards this, part, this, this twin flame, reconciling. This is them trying again to get this person to give up and give in. They do this every time. Two of cups. Up. They're going to say something to this person. Yeah, these karmics, they want to steal this two, this twin flame. They want to steal. They don't want these two people to come together. They're trying to steal that energy. Steal it. Steal it. They want growth. Like I said, they're trying to stop it from growing. Four swords reversed. They want someone to be seen as um, someone that is emotionally uh, unbalanced to themselves and others. They really want to like get someone to be seen a certain type of way. These are karmics that are all jealous and envious of a divine feminine or masculine. They want to be this person. That's why. They want to be this person. I feel like a lie are going to be exposed about who the Empress really is as well, too, when these two people come together. The lover, the tower reverse. These people thought they had some type of control. They don't. They thought that they had some type of success. And it backfired. That's why they want to. That's why, that's probably why they want a physical altercation with this divine feminine or masculine as well, because things are balancing out for this divine feminine. And this doppelganger energy is being seen as a doppelganger and being seen as someone that is unhealed and unfucking balanced. They're being exposed. Ace of Wands reverse. Ace of Wands upright person. Yeah, we got the Wheel of Fortune here. There's success here. This masculine is, is determined to move forward and he's going to have success. And this was going to happen regardless. Like, I don't know what these karmics thought. But in due time with this Wheel of Fortune, this new beginning was going to come. This situation was going to come, like, to an end. This, this whole energy where they thought that they could keep this person stagnant was, and, this, and this energy here, it was never going to work. Seven of Cups reverse. Yeah, something about bad memories here in the past. It's haunting someone. It involves, it could be this masculine being haunted by his decisions. He gave up on this connection. He gave in. And this is haunting this person. This person is suffering bad memories. Ten of Pentacles reverse, not a soul's reverse. Yep. He's being haunted. He, that's why this person is trying to release the past and move forward. That's why this person wants to release these karmics and move forward because it's haunting them what they did. They, everything is being exposed. They're having to look at the situation truthfully and stop pointing a finger and blaming this divine feminine. They're, they're having to take accountability. This person is being haunted. They probably not. If they're sleeping, they're not. They're having nightmares. You know, this person probably is not sleeping at all. The sun came by the sun upright. Yeah, it's being exposed that this person was unloyal and unfaithful. It's being exposed that this person was bored. All of this could have been done on purpose. Yeah, someone is getting clarity. They're no longer confused. Or the magic that was done to this person and who did it is being exposed. Yeah, it's being exposed that someone was cheating. They were definitely cheating. This masculine was cheating. The masculine or feminine, they were cheating. They were fooling, they were doing, they were overindulging in the cheating as well, too. And who who they were overindulging with is sexually frustrated and wants this person to go back to being unloyal and unfaithful. And wants this person to stay stagnant in that energy. Nine of Wands upright. They could have been drinking alcohol when they were. Dealing with this person. I feel like all the sex and all the love making or whatever y'all want to call it that they had with this karma, it caused a tower moment. It caused a bad tower moment. This person is trying to be at peace with that tower moment as well, too. Yeah, someone is trying to seven of pentacles. I feel like this, yeah, it caused a tower moment. And I feel like the tower moment, yeah. So the tower moment was like I keep saying in all my readings, they this masculine got together with a karmic to cause emotional damage 
to another for control. When they went and had all this sex and overindulged with this karmic, this is overindulging and this is also like alcohol. They could have been drinking a lot of alcohol when they were sleeping with this person. But I feel like they 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 did something too much. They overindulged, okay? There's clarity here for you. This person, not a pinnacles in the reverse. They were not at work. Maybe when they were supposed to be at work, they were not at work. This is being exposed with the sun card. This is all clar clarifying this sun card. Okay, this person could have Taurus in their birth chart. They could be a Taurus. They were not at work. They were having sex with someone. Okay, and it was to it was it was to hurt you, Divine Feminine. And what it did was nothing. You you you're at peace with the situation. You found peace. You grew. You found balance. You tempered yourself throughout this entire fucking situation, and it brought a tower moment to these people' sex life. That's what happened. When you were not affected, Divine Feminine, it made this masculine wake up to what they were doing. And it also made this masculine realize, like, so you really, you are strong. Like, you really strong enough to choose yourself. You know, this is a, this is a narcissist that you guys were dealing with. Someone that just wants to control and dominate you. Neither of ones reverse. Yeah, we have temperance. You balanced yourself out when this masculine was fucking and sucking and loving on a third on a, a third party or um, an ex. You guys were at peace. You're still at peace with it. You're still balanced. You're still healed. You healed through it. They were overindulging and fucking this third party, this ex, and you were healing. And it was all, they did this all to cause you a tower moment, to make you feel some type of way. Or this could be what's happening right now. Yeah, it was a, it was a group effort. It was a collaboration. It was, it was an idea. It was like, let's all get together and do this, you know, four cups upright. This is being exposed. Yeah. Yeah, this was done to you in secret, Divine Feminine Empress. They all got together in secret, Three of Pentacles. And this secret may or may not hurt you. They all got together in secret to do this. I don't feel like it's going to hurt you, though. I feel like, you know, you 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 good. You either heal from it or you're healing from through it right now. Like, they wanted to make you feel like you will never find love. Okay? Four of Cups. They wanted to feel like you would never find love. They want you to be afraid to move on. It's all it's all control, Divine Feminine Empress. It's all control. And it was all done behind your back. But you're still in your Empress upright energy. You're still moving forward. You're still birthing new ideas. You're still nurturing. You're still loving. You're still caring. You're still balanced. You're still at peace. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. They wanted to hold you down. Especially emotionally. They wanted you to be broken down. Four of Wands reverse. Yeah. The Sun reverse with the Ten of Pentacles. So in secret, this masculine released this home that they had with you. And they they could have got married to a third party. I feel like um, you know how Jada and what's that guy named? August Alcina got married, but they had a spiritual wedding. And her and Will Smith, they have a, they have like a physical wedding, on um, paperwork, legal wedding, you know. But she spiritually married August Alcina. I feel like that's what they did in secret with a third party. And this third party thought that they were going to get some type of ten of pentacles, some type of like, um... Some type of money, some type of inheritance out of this. They thought that they took it from you. They stole it from you, which is why the four of wands is supposed to be in the reverse for you. But it came out with three cups in the reverse. This didn't work. This didn't work. Page of wands reverse. They thought that this was going to work and they were going to inherit everything that belonged to the divine feminine, the empress or the divine masculine. Page of wands reverse. And it didn't work. Yeah. This karmic is pleading and begging a masculine to give up on a home situation, to give up on whatever relationship, whatever marriage that they have with you. This person is screaming 
this this doppelganger energy empress in the reverse energy this karmic is screaming at this masculine right now because this masculine could be being very um emotionally unavailable to this person as well too this person could be crying yeah because look they're getting warnings from the divine to stop. Stop begging this masculine and leave him alone. He's on his path. He's on his way to go to somebody else who he messed. He, it, this person got distracted or some type of magic was done. It was a lot of lies, a lot of gossip, a lot of magic, a lot of games, a lot of distractions. Like this, yeah, it's, it was, this was a lot of karmics that was involved and getting this person to do this this masculine overindulged they they had this masculine do it 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 to the point where it's like it was supposed to be no coming back for him but but they these karmics were being watched the whole time and the divine is saying it's time for these karmics to move forward it's time for them to move on stop begging and pleading this masculine stop trying to distract him he's on his right path he's he's gone he's gone it's over the star reverse. This magic backfired. These karmics are getting weaker. They they know that it's not working, but they are refusing to just move on with their life. Look, three of wands reverse. Ten of swords. They feel betrayed by this masculine because it was a group effort. They also feel betrayed by their their they, their uh fellow whoever else was in this group. They feel like these people stabbed them in the back, or this masculine stabbed them in the back. Ten of cups upright. Yeah, this ten of cups and this hair, hair font. This this. Marriage and this family situation still stands, and it's God that has the last say. They feel like they got betrayed, they got food, they got bamboozled, and I feel like they did. <laughs> What's the outcome? Mm -hmm. This karmic is trying to curse this masculine, and she's stalking and watching to see if it's working. Yeah, this person could be watching through divination or scrying, or actually like stalking. Especially the divine feminine, trying to like copy this person some more, trying to figure out how they can do this. Yeah, there's a new beginning. Somebody knows this new beginning. This this uh karmic could have been watching and she knows there's a new beginning and money coming. Yeah, that's the truth. Somebody is aware that there's there's a blessing from the divine coming. This this marriage and this family, this ten of cups does not belong to this karmic. They're trying to steal it. They had, they had this masculine in secret. And I feel like I'm hearing without him even knowing, but not to him, that he got married to this karmic. He got married to this karmic in secret, bro. Yeah, that's what this shit is telling me. He got married to this karmic in secret. And this karmic thought that they were going to inherit in everything that belonged to a divine feminine. And it didn't work out that way. They, they, they put magic over this masculine. All it took was one time for this masculine to have sex with this, this karmic. They put magic over this person for them to be in this energy. While this person was supposed to be at work, they were overindulging. They were getting drunk and having constant sex with a karmic. They were they overindulged. This this karmic wishes got fulfilled sexually when it came to this masculine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that this masculine fulfilled this karmic's wishes se uh, sexually for sure. And, and and it was all to to make a divine feminine unbalanced. It was all to make you come off as someone that is unhealed, unbalanced. You're not who you say you are. Like they were trying to like get you to be seen and feel some type of way. And it when it didn't work, when when it did not work, when you still remained healed, when you chose to heal, when you chose to balance yourself out, when you chose to be in that good energy, high vibrational energy. And at peace, it brought a tower moment sexually to these people. Life. They couldn't, like this masculine probably couldn't even get it up no more for this karmic. Or this karmic pussy couldn't even get wet no more for this masculine. These people are, they're not, the communication, everything started to fuck up. Like everything. Because it was solely based off of how you were supposed to feel, divine feminine. What's the outcome here? Yeah, these karmics that, that's, that's watching you, they're being watched. And they're, look, I can't make this shit up, bro. They need to, like, look around and realize that they're getting warnings from the divine to leave y'all relationship alone. Look, King of Pentacles in the reverse. They're trying to fucking fuck with a masculine's life to make him be the King of Pentacles in reverse. 
unloyal, unfaithful, or deadbeat, unable to provide. All because this person wants to give give his divine feminine what he know he was supposed to been gave or what he know he she deserves. He or she deserves. Yeah. All because this masculine is being confident in himself. And his decisions. All because of this. They want this person to lose a job. And yeah, we got the will of fortune here. The tables is gonna turn. And when they do, it's another warning from the fucking divine that these karmics are not paying attention to. Yeah, we got this empress energy out here now, upright. That's a divine feminine. Yeah, they keep trying to get this masculine to give up on this empress and not give her this offer. They keep trying to steal the offer. Like basically, that's what it was about. You know, they make this, there's somebody mom that was involved or an older energies or two older energies that was involved that made, that made this masculine marry a karmic spiritually. They, they, they did a lot of mind magic on this person. Like this person's mental is fucked because of these karmics. And they did all of that and they wish it still ain't fulfilled and it's not going to be fulfilled. It's not going to, this, this is not going to happen because you don't, you don't call the shots. You don't make the decisions here. Okay. There's like, there's an archangel that is helping this masculine remain in this king of pentacles upright energy as well. Remain loyal. Yeah. I can't make this shit up. Look, look, look at that. Archangels. Yeah. Archangels are remaining on, they're, they're helping this masculine miscarriage and incest. Yeah. If this masculine was involved with somebody ego and not the father that that was like in their family, this person suffered a miscarriage. It was all because the divine said so. Okay. Two-faced it, A, initial, and R. So there's somebody with the initial A and R that is two-faced divine feminine or masculine. All right. First, middle, or last in their name. They could be trying to tell someone that they're not the father of someone's child. Someone used ego as well, too. Ego. That's how they got this incest to go to work. If this masculine was involved with someone in their family, it was all based off this person's ego. They stroked this person's ego. They, they you know, yeah, we have divine masculine. Mm -hmm. And we have DNA tests. And we have emotional incest. It started off as emotional incest. It ended in incest. This person could have had a fucking miscarriage from this masculine because they got married. So they mean that they had sex unprotected. Somebody could be in their 30s or 33 exact. Okay. But this person, if, if the divine feminine is pregnant because the empress upright energy is here and it came, it came out for a divine feminine. If you guys are pregnant, they're now trying to convince this masculine that he needs to get a DNA test because you're not the father, because he's not the father of your child, okay? Somebody is two-faced. Somebody that you know, initial A and R in their name. Aries and Pisces is here. It's two-faced, okay? Beware. They're, they could be the ones that saying that this man is not your child's father, And that he should get a DNA test. What else is here? I'm heard jealous. Q, first, middle, or last, initial, and projection. Yeah, somebody with the initial Q could be projecting onto you. I feel like these people um, that's two-faced, they like to project onto you as well, too, Divine Feminine. But you are protected. Yeah, we have the initial D, first, middle, or last, a Gemini, 49. And divine feminine. What else is here? Shapeshifter twenty seven. Yeah, this this is a dot. This is giving doppelganger energy for real. Like W, the initial W is significant. Or this shapeshifter is a woman. This is a woman who likes to shapeshifter. Okay, sex addiction. This person has a god complex. The initial S could be significant, first, middle, or last. We have return to sender, 777, return to sender. O, first, middle, or last is significant. A Pisces, again, 29, soulmate, counterpart, divine, feminine, divine, masculine, twin flames. Mm -hmm. A lot about a pregnancy. So, like I said, if this motherfucker did not 
have this was not pregnant by this masculine. This person lied about a pregnancy. They were never pregnant at all. That's why they're the empress in the reverse. They, this person desperately wants to be the empress in this masculine's life. They want to marry this person. They really do. They had this masculine marry them spiritually. They made this person do it. It was all of this was like magic and like sex magic. And they had to do a lot to get all of this done by divine feminine. You didn't have to do all of this. They had this person confused. They right now they have this person at a crossroads. I feel like are trying to have them at a crossroads also. But either way it go, I, I feel like if they're trying to get this masculine to give up and give in on this Empress upright energy, he's not. He's not. It's not going to work. And they're watching. They're watching and they're going to see that it's not going to work. But they, they, they need to also take this as a warning from the divine. That this ten of cups and this hair fine energy is upright. Your marriage and your family is protected. It's all upright. Seven of wands in the reverse. They're not going to get this person to give in. What if I did seven of wands in the reverse? Yeah, we have the full reverse with justice in the reverse. They're doing this for negative reasons. They don't have a real reason as to why they want to do this to you, divine feminine. You're innocent in this situation. They just, they, this is an injustice that they want to do to you just to do it to you. Just, just to fucking do it. They don't even have a real reason. That's why it's not going to work. Yeah, Death. It's not going to work. That's done with. It's over with. Okay? They could be also trying to do death. It's a queen of pentacles in the reverse. They're trying to keep someone caged up. An older energy. I cannot make this shit up. This person could 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 um, suffer someone dying in their family or they could die. But whatever they're trying to do here to this queen of cups upright that's minding her business, this innocent person, keeping them in a never-ending cycle, this is over. This is over. They made this masculine indulge. He, he he did something too much, but it was because of these people. Like, I feel like he went towards a third party, and I feel like at first it wasn't working. And then it's like, he got a bad advice from this Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. Like, go ahead and keep doing it. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Keep fucking them. Keep doing it. You know, you know, just keep on trying. And that's what he did. And then it got to the point where it started to click, and the sex was good. Now all they got to do is get this divine feminine feel some type of way about it. So that he could have came home and threw it in your face. Like, look, it's all over my shirt. Like, look, it's all over. It's all over my pants. It's all over my back. Like, you know, jumping in the shower with you, knowing he rank up somebody else's pussy. Or knowing she smells like a condom, you know. You know, making you give her head. And you like, you know you smell like a condom, baby. Like, why would you do this? You know, like shit like that. And when they did that and it didn't work, it brought a tower moment to the whole fucking, the whole fucking project. Like, everything crumbled. Because instead of you choosing to indulge and feed into the bullshit, divine feminine, divine masculine, you guys walked away and healed and stayed balanced. Pray, I'm hearing prayed. You guys could have prayed a lot through this situation. Like, could have prayed yourself through this as well, too. This didn't work. This was like a bad investment, a bad plan. These people didn't know who you really were. They didn't know how strong you really were. Like, you survived a lot. You went through a lot because this masculine, it, it's like even when, what happened is, it's like when when he tried to stop, like once everything, I feel like also when, when the tire moment came as well, too, when this masculine tried to stop, he had already fell in love with this person because, you know, uh, feelings, uh, sex brings feelings, you know, and this and I feel like this woman did sex magic on this masculine while he was just thinking he was over there trying to get shit going and he's in control. He lost control. He lost control of himself. He lost control of the situation. He kept that's why that's why I'm saying it's like they kept getting drunk with this person and having sex with this person and they kept overindulging in it. It could have been this woman's idea, like, go get some alcohol and y'all smoke or y'all drink or, you know, have a good time when you're doing it. And, and you know, you're going to fuck it off anyway. So when you go home, you're going to be sober. You know, it's like all of that took place. But it was a bunch of lies and gossip and a bunch of bad ass advice. I feel like someone also abused their authority in this situation. And it's this older energies. It's these older energies. They they lied. 
But that was the messages, guys. Make sure to like, subscribe to the channel, and like the video, and take good care of yourself. Until next time, bye-bye.